Hey fam, happy Monday. Hope you guys had a fabulous weekend. You were able to get maybe caught up on some things and get some rest as well. Um, so you guys know what time it is. It is Motivational Monday. So coming to you guys with the word of the week, it is drum roll, diligence, stay in the course. You will see that I posted that earlier today on social media. And then I come to you guys to talk about it. Well, anyway, you know, when I thought about that staying in the course, it really came to me probably a month ago. There was a task, um, a series of tasks um, that I really felt very led um, to pursue um, during my quiet time and meditation time and my prayer time. And then all of a sudden, some obstacles started coming up and some challenges. So I was just like, mm, maybe I shouldn't do it. Maybe it's not meant to be. And then I could hear so clearly, um, stay the course. You are on the right path. Stay the course and pursue it and do what I'm telling you to do. So I know if that came to me during my prayer, my quiet time, that it's meant for me to share with others. So that's why I'm on sharing today. So you guys, it's just stay in the course. I know um, sometimes people look at like stay in the course, um, it was used a lot during like war and battle, uh, which means no matter what kind of obstacles or what kind of opponents or criticism may come in your path, just be like, okay, I I can't, you know, even address that. I can't even deal with you right now. I just need to stay the course. And you know, sometimes the challenges and obstacles will come and we do have to deal with them. We can't just push them aside. Um, it may be a little thing that we need to do to check it off the list or to get help and just keep pressing through. So anyway, I just uh, come to you and I'm telling you, stay focused, stay the course. There are going to be things that are going to come to easily distract you, to take you off focus, um, to even second guess yourself because we do that a lot, that self-talk. Um, the unhealthy self-talk, replace that with some healthy self-talk. Like, I can do this. I was meant to do this. I know this is what I'm supposed to be doing. Just have some things already built up or either written down. So when those moments do come, you can just say, nope, let me go read my positive affirmations, uh, my scriptures, things like that. So I am telling you, stay the course, stay focused. Keep driving home at that thing that you're supposed to be doing, especially if you know in your heart and with every fiber of your being, this is what you're called to do or called to be. You're going to have challenges. They're just going to make you stronger and make you grow. But I can't say it enough. Stay the course. And as you hear people say, haters are going to hate. And I always say this too. Critics are going to criticize. So you know what? Just let them do that. That probably means you're on the right path anyway when you start all hearing all that negative or not even negative, but some of that feedback, um, you know, to things that you're doing or trying to accomplish. So I just leave you with this tidbit is stay focused that we will succeed in the end if we stay focused and stay the course. So I hope that takes you through the whole week this week or maybe even through the whole month or whatever, whenever you need that little phrase, maybe write it on a post-it. I actually have mine. Let me share it with you. I have mine on a post-it. I've had it since that day it came to me. Stay the course. So wanted to share that with you guys. I hope you have an awesome week and an awesome day and I will talk to you later, okay? Bye-bye.